Okay, let me make sure this is recording. And I just, um, I was actually going to go ahead and come back when he got home. But as you can see, it is raining. Um, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, I guess we'll just uh, stay on. He's got no energy. He didn't get any sleep. But he he does have a pretty good mood. Judy Bunch. Okay. Um, and I'm going ahead just keeping him meet, fi meet fellow scientists because... Uh, Hopefully, somehow, that will, um, we got a ra uh, raise, excellent, but hopefully that will pay off, uh, with him getting items, okay, leisure day, okay, good, so he can, uh, we don't have to worry too much about that, because he can just go to the festival later on in the day, again, let me spastically make sure this is recording, yeah, okay, so yeah, rain, and here's the puddles that, like it's heavy rain, they they make puddles. Um, I do have an umbrella, so he will use it. Where is it? So yeah, he will use that rain disruptor. My bad, rain disruptor. Um, it looks like he will need to eat, but he might eat at work, possibly. Yeah, he's in a bad mood. He's met all his co-workers so he can work hard because it's just he's sleepy. It's not anything to do with him being stressed out. Okay, is this going to get him a promotion? Uh, no, but that's okay. We just need him some money to live on. Okay, so uh, just have him come home. And, uh, I'm going to go to sleep. He'll eat when he wakes up. And I guess we'll cut back in here when he wakes up. Okay, and we're back. Um, he's getting ready to get up. I have to have him clean the counter so that he can, um, actually prepare some food because the, a quick meal is just won't get him up. And let's give him that little, little bit of rest there. When's he going to wake up? One. No, you don't get to sleep till one. Okay, let's go ahead and just cut that off there. And I've got to fast forward for him to clean that. Yes, honey, I know you're hungry. You're going to eat. If you cleaned these bowls before, you wouldn't have this problem now, would you? Okay, serve dinner mac and cheese. Actually, no. I don't want you to burn the house down. Serve dinner and salad. I mean, it's a handy sim, which means he can successfully repair just about anything, whether it's broken or not. Ooh. Are you kidding me? Oh. Uh. <sighs> Color repair technician, because we're going to be busy stargazing. So, yeah. Once again, we're just going to fast forward to his daily thing. Um, I'm hoping real soon we, <laughs> we get something, because it's going to be pretty boring if all we do is... Um, stargaze all the time. So, slide that into the fridge there. I also might replace that fridge because, like, if I remember correctly, things spoiled really quickly with it. Just gonna get him to his stargazing. Are you gonna clean up after yourself? You are for once. Right on. Okay. The repair technician will arrive in an hour. Excellent. Um, how does he make in a, How much does he make in a day? Fifty. And he works about five. So he makes enough to pay the maid, as long as we don't have any glitches. That took him way too long to get stargazing. He's not going to get any stargazing done. It's not a good thing, but that's okay, I suppose. So yeah, this is mainly us, him watching, us watching him stargaze. Oh, okay. One day into fall. And it's leisure day, which is a good thing because we've got three days off. So hopefully, with us not having to worry, where's, here we go. With these three days off, with us not having to worry about uh, work, he can actually, um, 
to actually concentrate on. He needs to pay these bills. Okay. Are you want to buy a chess table, maybe, on handiness? Take class. Maybe. But I really want him to be a knight, be, you know, concentrating on this, at least until it happened was once. Uh, like I said, the previous challenge was you get abducted as many times. Um, you were allowed to use the, uh, they had a uh, telescope that basically was, you use this telescope, you will get abducted. Um, and uh, you were allowed to use that. But essentially the thing was you get abducted as many times as possible and see if you can actually take care of the children and everything. And the premise of it was everyone is uh, essentially afraid of the children and of the alienness and a lot of, uh, I think it's called xenophobia. Okay, or done, good. So basically that's why you couldn't get a job, that's why you couldn't have any outside help except for like a babysitter because nobody in the town wanted to approach you know the male they were afraid of him and afraid of the kids and um, you know so yeah which I, I mean to actually have a backstory as to why you can't do certain things in the challenge I think was pretty cool and he's just gonna keep stargazing Leisure day is here. Um, well, goodness, um, you may go to the. Oh, you want to throw a pool party? No, that ain't happening because you don't have a pool, dude. Okay, let's see. Okay, he's stargazing. Okay, I think he's looking through now. Yeah, it just switched over to look through. So I'm gonna go ahead get him. Nope. Get all of his moods up. And, um, come back in. Let him go to the festival for a while. Uh, oh, no, it's a little glitchy. I don't think so. Let him go to the festival for a while. And, um, then come back and stargaze some more. So, we'll check out the festival. And, uh, when he wakes up. So I'll see you soon. Okay, he just got up. Uh, make sure this is recording. Okay, we're just gonna have him go to the festival. Focus back on him. And um, I'm gonna try to do the uh, photo booth thing. Um, if it glitches out, I'll cut out and come back in again. I'm sorry to be doing this so much for this, but uh, uh, otherwise we'd just be fast forwarding through stuff so and I'll have him eat while he's there let's get on our way shall we so yeah we got one day until fall now it'll take a bit okay and I'm gonna let everything load because that may be my problem so I'll talk as we let uh, everything load he wants to make a snow cone he can do that. Uh, his face painted. I've not actually done that. So, hmm. Hmm. Face paint, face paint. How much is it worth? Uh, no. Both of these are worth quite a bit more. Is that worth? No. It's quite a bit more. So, no. We're not going to worry about that. Okay. So, once again, we're going to let things load a little bit more. I did do that right, right, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, flowers, neat. Oh, he can pick it. Well, okay. Can he, um... Oh, here's soccer. Um, we'll have him play a little bit of soccer. Some fireworks we can set off, so... We can do that. As, as you see, it's just taking its great time to load. I dread what the snow is going to do to my game. I really do. But, um... Get him set up. 
to take a greeting card photo. Let's just go ahead and see if it glitches out. If it does, I'll come back in when he's reset back, when he's back here. And my game is pretty decently stable except for a few minor flaws, so I really guess I can't complain. So. Okay. And then we gotta set him up to eat. So let's just not put anything in his queue. And then we'll set him up to. Okay, he's gonna take forever to. See, this is the problem I think they have is they took too long to go in. Okay. Okay, there we go. He didn't glitch out, and we got a summer greeting card. And what I may try to do, let me pause real quick because I found the food stands. Um, what I may try to do, okay, buy food, is um, have him take a greeting card picture in each uh, seasonal festival. So, but yeah, I mean, I've had a few weird things in the previous saves about the photo card issue about aging. So I'm not sure if it's se seasons per se. Come on, get over here. Come on. Okay, there we go. Or if it's just things don't load and the game freaks out. I don't know, but. Uh, Oh, I was going to have him get a snow cone. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. We can make that during any season, so we can save that because it's... Okay, um, I think we had chili cheese fries before, so how about some onion rings? Oh, and he did get money for being off uh, for Leisure Day. Now, then after he eats, let's have him skate. And, uh, oh, he's clumsy. See, like, the, these things still haven't loaded. I, I, I swear they're supposed to be brown. I swear they are. <laughs> but it's okay. I will be getting a better computer, and it will not take so long to load. I might have a, have a snow cone before he goes home. Uh, mm, mm. Oh, he's clumsy too. Mm, mm. See? See? Like, he's been here for two hours. This lot has been attempting to load for two sim hours. And look at this. Look. Did she just load as I was saying that? Yeah. She wasn't loaded like two seconds ago. <laughs> so, actually, you know, I think I had him skate before. Let's have him play some soccer. Shall we? Join now. Who, who we got here? We've got uh, Bebe Hart. Uh, who are you? Tamara Donner, Linda Duran, and Emma Hatch. Okay. So he's going to come over here and join. And since he is going to be in some sort of relationship with an alien, uh, we're not really going to worry about finding him a love interest. So, but as he's making his way over. There's a seed. Spain. Okay. Uh, so far I don't see anything else. Oh, there's the tanning booth. He could tan. I don't think I had him tan before. So he's playing with... Uh, he's going to be goalie. And she's going to be shooting. Maybe Hart's going to be shooting some balls. Okay, here we go. Oh, and I did save. Yeah. Uh, normally I only save... Um, okay, we're going to start the interaction. <sighs> anyway, normally I only save at the end of a day. Like, when I, oh, Bella Goss. I mean, Bella Bachelor. Who is she here with? A Cyclone Sword. Okay. Well, while they're waiting to start, let's, oh. Do we, do we start? Nope, nope, we didn't start. Okay, let's go back over here. Um, here's the face painting stuff. Like I said, the skating rink, which I think he did skate a little bit before. Okay, he just canceled out of it. Oh, there we go. 
Okay. Oh, he had to change clothes. And my game froze. Awesome. There we go. And she's going to have to change probably, so we're going to be here for still a little bit. Yeah, we're, we're feeling, yeah, we feel it too, hon. It's taking forever for you to start. Get, uh, it, okay, well that was a bust. Let's just uh, practice. Let me see if we can get that interaction going. We, we, okay, here we go, here we go. Here's the soccer, so let me get a better view here. Okay. And he's, um, if I'm not mistaken, that's athletic that he's leveling up. Looks like he can do another day of stargazing because he's fed. He's going to be, use the bathroom and, uh, so yeah, I think, uh, I think we could send him home. Okay. Oh, Just do. So yeah, that's the, like I said, summer festival. Um, again, it just takes everything a lot to load in my game. So maybe I'm just not being patient enough. So probably every time he goes to, to the festival, I'll pause it for a bit. Okay. And we're just going to get him bathed and then we're going to start gaze. Okay. And we'll fast forward this till he gets out here. Again. Okay. Just basically checking that it was saving again because that's what I do. Oh yeah, visible sim on a bike just went by. That's normal in my game. But yeah, I don't know whether it's I do have custom clothes, whether it's just the processor. Okay, here we go. So let's uh I'm gonna try to keep him at this till about five. So uh five or six. Well I think five is when it shoots over to look through. As soon as it does that, we'll have him stop. Okay, let's back up a little bit. Let's see if we can look at the sky again. Okay, let's back up again. There we go. Okay, that's the venue lights. Actually, I didn't realize he lived that close to the venue. That's kind of awesome. Okay. So, yeah, we're just watching this guy with him. Let's do a little fast forwarding here. Okay, so he got uh, a large scale of five. What does he now want? He wants to discover a star. Well, we'll get rid of that snow cone because that's probably, yeah, it's a little bit more for him. So, why did that go so far away? <laughs> so, yeah, just kind of Watch him again. Oh, what are we? Is this hail or is this rain? I should have checked the weather. Ah, that is hail, people. That is hail going on right now, and he is all out of it. He seems to be ignoring it, though. I don't see anything happening to his mood. See, that's the thing that, like, the, the one thing that I don't... Because, like, hail in The Sims 2 would kill you, but it doesn't kill you in The Sims 3. So I don't know if you're going to move it at some point. You know, so... Because I know you get soaked for the rain if you have a parasol. I mean, uh, a rain disruptor. <clears throat> we just start to fall, 